Hi everyone, today we are going to write a simple Java code to check if a word is palindrome or not. So let me quickly create a class. Okay. So the name is palindrome checker. We check if a word or a string, given string, is palindrome or not. Let me take the main method. So before we write the code, we have to understand the logic behind it. Okay, in the interviews, as always, they always ask you to write a method. So we're going to write a method that checks if a given string or a parameter string is palindrome or not. So first, let's define what is palindrome. Palindrome, usually a word, phrase, or sequence that reads the same backward and forward. Right now, we're going to just write a word or string. So, it's a word, or let's say a text that reads that reads the same backward as forward forward for instance madam if you read madam from right or left from backward or forward it reads the same madam right so we have to check we're going to write a method let me quickly write a method public static I'm going to written as a boolean if it's palindrome then it's true if it's not it's false so I'm going to make a type as boolean is palindrome writes string because we're going to check a text or word CSTR okay so in order to write that we have to keep in mind that every word or text is made of letters or chart or characters so if we read from right to left and left to right if it's same then we will just return as true or false if it was same then it's true or else it's false for instance I'm going to declare a variable as reverse because we have to find reverse we have to somehow find the reverse of the word, given word, let's say it's the given word. We're going to check if madam is palindrome or not, okay? We're going to write the reverse, we're going to find reverse, and if we, the reverse equals to the original word, bingo, then it's palindrome, or else it's not palindrome. So let me just quickly declare a variable as reverse and I put it as null because I'm going to put char from backward to forward. The combination of the chart will be its reverse. So I declare as null because I'm going to add that using assignment operators. So let me quickly write a for loop. For instance, here, the main logic is I have to put backward M, then I concatenate A, then D, then A, then M. That's the logic behind it. Okay, so I'm going to write a for loop. And remember, so the first, the first 
character first letter for the reverse is the last letter for the origin, right? The last letter for the origin is the first letter for the reverse. So it has to start, the loop has to start from the last letter. Le how do we find the last letter? By the length of the string, right? It equals to str length because it starts from the length starts from zero, so we have to minus minus one. And it has to be greater or equals to zero. So the last element would be m. Loop until the last element here. Decrement. It's post decrement. So I'm going to use assignment operators reverse equals to reverse plus str each char at method i. In this case, the rever we will find the reverse. How? For instance, let's suppose the first Index would be the length, the length OS, for instance, how many? One, two, three, sorry, five. We minus one, then four, right? So from four to zero, it loops through. First, it finds zero, M, sorry. First, it finds M, then in this case, the reverse, the first here, the reverse value, is null right so here it's null reverse null then here it's also null then plus first loop that it returns m m so it eventually it will be m and first loop, first loop. Then second, in the reverse, here the reverse equals to M. And second loop, the next, it will be A. So it will be MA. Just it keep going at the last, we will find the reverse. It loops through until zero. Okay? Hope you understand the logic. So according to the assignment operator, instead we can just write it. We can change it like this. It's the same, right? Assignment operators. Now I'm going to use a simple if statement to check if reverse equals to since uh, it, the, the palindrome the rating is important so let's just ignore the case if reverse equals in our case that original no, original word which is str then it returns true because based on the definition a palindrome is a text or word that reads the same backward as forward else it return false yeah that's it We have to check. So let's print as palindrome. We put the word. If returns true, because we know madam is a palindrome word. If it returns true, it means our 
method is correct, our code is correct. Yeah, true. Okay, let's change it to different. For instance, this is not the palindrome, right? Yeah, false. How about low? LOL. True, right? It's palindrome because if you read backward and forward, same, right? Yep. Means our code is correct. That's it. Thank you.